So uh, welcome uh, everyone. So it's really a pleasure to uh, have uh, this uh, impressive conference in biology here at IHS. So um, the first thing I would like to say is really to thank the organizer, uh, François Kepes, Michel Gromov, and uh, Nadia Morozova. Uh, so I would like also to thank uh, Elisabeth Jasran, who did the wonderful work of organization, and uh, also uh, the scientific committee, uh, the speakers, and uh, we have a wonderful list of speakers, and uh, also probably uh, the discuss discussants, which is a, a nice notion introduced uh, maybe by Misha, and I really think it's a, a nice way of organizing a conference, and uh, it's, uh, I hope, uh, uh, the, the, the discussions you will have between uh, biologists and uh, mathematicians will be very uh, fruitful. So uh, I would like to maybe explain a little bit uh, what is IHS, uh, because maybe uh, uh, IHS is not uh, on uh, the roadmap of uh, uh, the, the biologists in general. So in a few words, uh, IHS uh, uh, was created uh, in '58 uh, by uh, uh, an industrial, Leon Bachan, uh, who wanted to uh, create a, an institute on the model of the Institute for Advanced Study uh, in Princeton. Uh, so he wanted to have a private foundation, uh, and uh, the, the, the idea was to have a the scientist at the highest level in math and in uh, theoretical physics at the beginning, and uh, to uh, host a program of visitors. So uh, uh, this was a, a great success from start because they, he was able to attract a, a really uh, pr prominent uh, scientist and. Uh, <coughs> Uh, for, exa for example, uh, uh, out of uh, 10 uh, mathematicians uh, hired at the institute, seven uh, uh, were awarded the first medal. And uh, we had uh, uh, some uh, really uh, first class mathematicians like uh, Grothendieck, René Tom, or Misha uh, here. Uh, another, so around this small uh, college of uh, uh, permanent professors, we have uh, some CNRS uh, uh, scientists at the, at, at the highest level also, and we host a, a very uh, huge program of uh, uh, visits. So uh, every year, we host um, more than 200 uh, visitors from all the world, and uh, this makes uh, something like 500 months of visits. And uh, uh, for example, I mean, one third are uh, American based. So we are really uh, international in this aspect. And for example, in the last 10 years, we host uh, 60 uh, different nationalities. Uh, so we hope that uh, uh, we are able to create a, a, an atmosphere of discussion. And I hope. Uh, you will feel this atmosphere during uh, this conference. Uh, uh, okay, we uh, our structure is uh, really a private foundation in the interest of the public, and uh, we are uh, supported by the French government, who uh, give us pa uh, half of uh, our budget annually, but. Uh, we are also supported internationally by uh, uh, some main uh, scientific uh, agencies uh, as NSF, uh, ERC, uh, the Swiss Fund, the Max Planck Gesellschaft, uh, or uh, the, the Belgium government. And uh, uh, over the years, we also have been able to create an endowment fund who now represent, uh, with interest, 20% of our budget. So uh, we are mainly, so as I said, uh, uh, oriented 
toward the theoretic aspect in math and uh, in uh, uh, theoretical physics. But uh, we have uh, tried to have an eye on uh, biology. And I think we started with uh, René Tom, uh, who was a permanent professor here. So uh, after some uh, uh, important work uh, for chaos uh, theory and uh, differential geometry, uh, <coughs> he uh, tried to create uh, the basics of uh, mathematics for morphogenesis. And uh, I think then uh, <coughs> the next step for the institute was uh, Misha, uh, who um, after uh, uh, infinite number of uh, uh, contribution to mathematics, uh, uh, started to um, be really uh, uh, fascinated by uh, uh, biology and, uh, and want to contribute to theoretical aspects of uh, uh, biology. And uh, he tried to uh, have here uh, a group of uh, people uh, able to, f to uh, interact with biology and to organize uh, some seminars uh, uh, to invite uh, some uh, uh, very top level uh, biologists uh, into the institute and uh, to uh, maintain a discussion between uh, mathematicians and uh, physicists. And uh, uh, another aspect is uh, to try to do this by organizing this kind of conference and uh, so uh, I'm really glad uh, to see that uh, uh, this kind of conference attracts uh, a lot of people. And uh, I would like to really uh, welcome you and hope you will have a wonderful week uh, here. <laughs> All right, everybody. Good morning. I'm not François Képès. For two minutes, I'll be representing uh, Pierre Tambourin, who is the head of uh, Genopole. And so I'll say a few words on what is Genopole and, uh, and, and where the uh, cooperation between uh, Genopole and IHES originate. Um, so first of all, uh, Genopole is the premier uh, biotech and biotherapy cluster in France and possibly uh, in Europe, with over 80 companies and 20 academic labs and 20 uh, technological platforms. It's located in Paris area in the southern suburbs of Paris and uh, has been involved with systems biology since 1999 and in synthetic biology since 2005, notably with the first network of scientists in synthetic biology. Among other things, and companies which are interested or using uh, or applying synthetic biology, um, the Institute of Systems and Synthetic Biology has been created there in Genopole, in, founded in 2007. And uh, the uh, first uh, synthetic biology platform called Appsthin was uh, founded uh, there as well in 2009. And I should perhaps mention also a master's degree in systems and synthetic biology, which started in, uh, in, in uh, 2009 as well. So now a word on the cooperation between uh, the Institut des Hautes Études Scientifiques, IHES, and Genopole since at least 2000, as far as I can say, um, was based on, I believe, on the realization that uh, there is a need for cross-disciplinarity in the new type of biology that was starting with genomics. Um, and on the, uh, based also on the fact that uh, the school of mathematics in France is very strong. Um, and so it started there, as uh, Dr. Ulmo has said, with a, a cycle of seminars and also with some uh, conferences. <coughs> and I believe that uh, this is both appealing to biologists in this transdisciplinary setting, but also to mathematicians in different ways, uh, inspiration and contribution, direct contributions as well. So in some sense, this conference beautifully illustrates this, this cooperation. 
Now, I'll, I'm Francois Kepes. Um, and I'd like to say that um, this cooperation was also illustrated in some sense with, by the, uh, the scientific friendship between Misha and, 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 and me and others uh, during all these years. And uh, this conference, uh, or the idea of this conference, originates from uh, Misha's, uh, re really from Misha initially. Uh, after some discussions that also included later the members of the scientific committee, we converged on the notion that we could use this conference for a critical assessment of synthetic biology, its status, its uh, implicit uh, grounds, groundings, um, and, and, and more specifically, uh, through an examination of what was the status of its uh, keywords, or should I say buzzwords, related to uh, engineering. So, this is a good occasion for me to, on our behalf, to thank all the scientific committee members who worked very hard to prepare this conference, and some of them, fortunately, can be with, with us and will be chairing sessions. Of course, we'll thank the speakers, but we'll thank them e even more after the, after the speeches. Thank the math, mathematic, mathematician discussants um, who can possibly get some inspiration uh, from uh, this conference, but will undoubtedly ask disturbing questions, beware of that. Um, thank Nadia Morosova, who helped us organize the conference as a scientist based here at IHES. Of course, Elisabeth Jasseron and her colleagues for what they did um, uh, on the logistics sides, the poster, the web pages, and uh, many of you have interacted with Elisabeth about their own the preparation of their own trip. And finally, I'll, I'd like to mention and thank our sponsors. Of course, foremost is IHES, but I'd like to thank Genopole, the Conseil Régional Regional Council of the Paris area, Conseil Régional Ile-de-France, um, the Institute of Complex Systems of Paris area, ESC, the LabEx of Mathematics, Jacques Ademar, and also the European Systems Biology Network, uh, uh, which has been uh, directed by Udo Reichel, who is part of this committee, um, and me during eight years, and is ending at the end of this month. And in some sense, I think, we hope, it's going to be a very nice ending to this, to this eight-year uh, uh, network of systems biology. And uh, to be sure, uh, a lot of the ideas that I have in mind, or I had in mind as I was preparing this conference, also came from discussions over the years with Udo Reichel. So now um, I'd like to hand over to Misha Gromov to say a few words. Misha. OK, one is a practical matter. Ah, here. Because you see in the scientific building downstairs, there is a, this a room, uh, Leon Machan, where those who want may have little sub-sessions. And there, there is a paper board where you can write in pencil. So if you want to have some meeting and some group, et cetera, just to schedule to fix it, yeah. That's just practical. And generic, just again for biologists to have an idea why mathematicians are here. And so what brought this meeting? And the background to the starting point, but now, of course, diverged, was that, you know, there are this emergence of antibiotic resistant uh, bacteria. And of course, for mathematicians, a great problem. What to do that? It's really fun. Yeah, it's not like maybe it's a bad thing having humanity. For mathematicians, potentially very interesting. How the hell to help handle it? And we mathematicians believe we can solve any problem. But we cannot solve it, of course. But at least we can pretend we participate in this listening to biologists. And so you just here to convince us that it's an interesting problem. And maybe we can say a couple of words, but again, imagining we help to solve it. And that's. And also, I wanted to mention, yeah, well, I'm thanks to Francois Capest, who actually made the major bulk of the work, finding all these great people coming here. So.